Hi there, this is David, and welcome to Let's Play Dragon Quest XI Echoes of an Elusive Age for the PlayStation 4. This is going to be a blind Let's Play, but that doesn't mean that I'm going to be skipping things or anything else like that. That means that I'm just going to be really taking my time to make sure that I get 100% without using a guide or anything else, just using my own wits. I tend to be very thorough whenever it comes to Dragon Quest games, and this should be no exception. So let's just go ahead and dive right on in. Oh, we get a little cutscene here. I'm going to be quiet for this opening cutscene. Cool. I approve. Oh, that opening with the um, dragon right there? That's very reminiscent of Dragon Quest 1 for the um, for the NES, at least the, um, the Japanese version. Kind of like a dragon going on like that. So yeah, uh, with that, let's go ahead and get started. Create a new adventure log. Uh, let's see, we'll just name my guy after me. That's perfectly fine. Uh, let's see. Oh, nope, there we go. I know how to spell my own name. I'm not an idiot. Uh, yeah. Um, it looks fine to me. Sure. Sure. Was that a Draki hanging on the, um, tree right there? I barely even looked at it, but it looked like it was to me. Oh, another cutscene! Ah. What's going on here? This little ghost guy, or, whoa, something. Kind of reminds me of White from Final Fantasy IV DS. White sucked, but <laughs> just the first thing that came to my mind, I guess. Whoa! What is this? This also reminds me of something from Tales of Zestiria. Uh-oh. Is this rain gonna turn you to stone like in Dragon Quest VII? The way that everybody's running, maybe. The cursed rain? Evil rain? Who are these guys? A bunch of different kings, it looks like. They all have crowns on. Some sort of meeting? This child. Is the one. There's the mark. There's no mistaking it. Hmm. 
And yeah, we get voice acting in this game. Um, the Japanese version did not get any voice acting at all. Whoa! The castle's under attack! Is this moon drop? Oh, the battle music too. Nice! This must be the hero's sister, I imagine. I mean, the mother of course. Ooh, that was horse boys. The mother, of course, is running the basket, but the girl will be the sister. Something tells me the mother's gonna die, and the sister is more than likely gonna raise the baby. Yes? Oh. Well, as we all know, no hero actually has parents. I mean, come on, this is a Dragon Quest game. Oh! Oh no! And she died. Oh, it's like Moses, I guess. Oh. <laughs> After that awful storm, too. However, did you survive? <laughs> You're a jolly one. What's this? You poor thing. Come here. Come here. Oh, there's no need to be frightened anymore. You're safe now, little fellow. Is it just me, or does the baby kind of look like Charlie Brown? Something with the hair. Ooh. The World Tree as well. Or Yggdrasil Tree, I guess they call it in the more modern versions. Used to be the World Tree. Back in the good old days, at least. <laughs> On his 16th birthday? More than likely. Oh wow, the tree's like floating. Wasn't it attached by, you know, wasn't it on the mountains earlier? It was kind of attached, but now it's floating in air. This is a different tree or just a different angle. Thanks so much, you're a lifesaver. Trust me to lose my headscarf just before the big ceremony. <sighs> so it's finally here, the big day. I can't believe we're going to be climbing all the way up there. Hmm? <laughs> Looks like Sandy's keen to lead the way. Come on, best not keep her waiting. <laughs> I love the British voice acting. I'm so excited. Oh, cobblestone tour base. Okay. So let's look around. Let's see. We can move around with our... Oh, oh okay, you're going to follow me. That works too. Hey there. Um, no, I haven't. Oh. Can I just leave? No, I can't. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. So let's see. We'll just go on through here. This is gorgeous. This is just absolutely gorgeous. Oh. Yeah, I'm just kind of twirling around, looking around. Oh, wow. Can I go through there? No, I can't. So yeah, you guys have asked me many times for blind Let's Plays. Well, now you got one. <laughs> Okay, so let's see. Oh, by the way, if you guys know of anything that you would like for me to do, or you, um, wait, wait, your mother's alive? Oh, wow. Or if you know of anything that I missed, tell me in the comments. 
Okay, so the pretty pink speech bubble will be people that tell you what to do. Okay. So you could just square button to look at the map. Oh, I see. There's another pink bubble uh, over there, I guess, as well. Hey there. Oh. So this is like a test of courage or something? I guess so. Wedding bells? Oh. I was almost wondering if it was his sister, but I guess not. It's just his village friend or something. Oh, well thanks. Do my best. Eh, you will eventually. Is Gemma a knight? Oh, Gemma, I think, is that girl, right? I don't know. Yeah, okay, so Gemma's that girl with me. I was thinking it was, like, the knight from Secret of Mana, but that's somebody else. <laughs> oh, okay. Sweet. Let's try that. And Amber's the mother, or adoptive mother, I guess? Oh. I wonder if Sandy's gonna join our party. Like, uh, what was the dog's name in, um, Tales of Vesperia? Oh, we got a little menu here. I'm shocked. Brilliant! Oh, I was hoping that she would say all this in party talk, but I guess not. That's fine. This is in our menu. We can do equipment, we can do attributes. Okay. This is, a uh, pretty standard Dragon Quest stuff here. Let's see. Magic. Oh, no, 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 I don't want to do party talk again. No, 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 shut up. Okay. <laughs> What's in miscellaneous? He law, tactics, traveler's tips. Oh. Okay, so yeah, this is tutorial stuff. Oh, what is this? Okay, yeah, so there's more stuff. Quest catalog. Oh, there's various quests. Huh. Uh, maybe volume settings, sound of voices. Yeah, let's... Actually, let's turn music down to nine and keep voices up. Hopefully that will help with, um... Oh, I've actually already... Yeah. Yeah, I... I, I before starting this, I, um... I put in some DLC codes. So, yeah, let's go ahead and do all this. Get some seeds of skill. Get the elevating vest. I could have gotten more stuff if I bought this on Amazon, but I didn't. Um, so, yeah. Ooh! Let's, uh, equip this. Um, let's see how I can equip this. Uh, here? How do I equip this stupid thing? This one? Oh, where is it? Transfer to David? There we go. Okay. Yes, definitely. Oh, wow, it lowers his defense by a ton. But, yeah, it makes him gain more equipment, so... Or more experience, so... That's kind of nice. Hey there. Ooh, okay. Kind of strange how you still have to, like, transfer equipment to, you know, each individual person, but this is a Dragon Quest game. This is very traditional. So, yeah, it's not too strange. So go in that cave to get to the top of the mountain? Sounds like a plan. Humble folk of cobblestone, great land spirits, hearth and home. That's how it goes, isn't it? My granddad's been teaching me the prayer ever since I was little. He reckons the spirit of the land really does live on cobblestone tour, you see. As long as I can remember, he's been preparing me for this day. The day it would finally be my turn to climb all the way up there and offer my thanks. I just wonder whose idea it was in the first place, sending the village's young folk on such a dangerous errand. What if I take a tumble and do myself a mischief? Well, not to worry. Since you and me were born on the same day, I'm lucky enough to have a bodyguard along for the journey. Come on, then. That craggy old thing won't climb its... Oh! Uh-oh. Yikes! Slimes! Oh, no! Ah! Monsters! They're coming this way! Yikes! 
Oh, they're so cute! It's adorable! Okay, so yeah, we'll go ahead and uh, fight them. So yeah, I can't imagine there's really much else to do. Wait, is Gemma not gonna join my party? Oh, well, Sandy's helping out at least, so that's kind of nice. Wow, this girl is useless. You're gonna... Oh. Hey, that's not too bad. You get to paralyze one and then kill the other one? Man, Sandy's pretty damn good. I really hope that Sandy stays with my party for quite a long time. I kind of doubt it, though. Ooh. Ooh. Crikey, I wasn't expecting that. Oh, I know they were only little, but I'd have been done for if you and Sandy hadn't been here to help me. And now we've got to go through that horrible, dingy cave. Just our luck. I'll bet you anything that's where those awful things came from. Well, as long as you're with me, I've got nothing to worry about. Come on, let's get going. Okay. Let's see. Let's uh go over here first. I just want to check out this little monolith, I guess. Oh. Well, it just says the same thing that she said earlier. Ooh, treasure! Oh. Okay. Um, okay. <laughs> let's see, uh, let's see. I want to equip that. Let's see, so here we go. Pot lid, there we are. Oh, wow, this is much easier to uh, equip stuff, isn't it? Huh. Okay, so I guess I was in the wrong menu earlier when I was trying to equip stuff. I need to go inside the equipment menu. It'll make my life so much easier. Hey there, Sandy. Oh, can I look at this? Okay, yeah. Wow, there's all these ruins, and it's just so nice. I love the scenery. This is just, uh, the, the level of detail, the music. I approve. Oh, this is nice. Reminds me of the water, waterfall cave from Dragon Quest V. You know, the one where you have to go into to get Bianca's um, hand of marriage and all that. Oh, and there's a slime! We have on-screen enemies! Hey! We didn't even have that in Dragon Quest VIII, but we have it here. What's this? Oh! Oh, wow! We can climb? Cool! Cool, 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 cool. I approve. What is this? Oh, okay. Another medicinal herb. Awesome. Oh, medicinal herbs, basically, they restore your HP if you use them as an item, or if you use them in battle. I mean, if they work at, like, all other medicinal herbs in every other Dragon Quest game. Oh. Okay. Press X, you give them a wallet with a weapon. Oh. I'll give it a shot. I'm not really good at this stuff, but hey, we did it! Awesome. So, yeah, just same thing. Whoa! Ooh, and I learned a new spell as well. Frizz, which I guess is like the blaze spell, which deal roughly 10 damage to a monster. Oh, also, I found out, I went inside the equipment menu, and um, you can have a great sword equipped as well, which will actually increase your attack power by um, four more points. So I went ahead and I equipped that as well, just during the battle as I was kind of fooling around in the item menu and everything. Okay, moving right along. We've got some more slimes over here. Oh, here's a new monster. Bam! Needlers? I don't think I've ever seen these in a Dragon Quest game. These guys must be new. Let's try our new Frizz spell. Woohoo! Yeah, it's kind of useless, I've gotta say. Maybe if you get hit with the Surround spell, um, you might want to use Frizz because Surround, you know, lowers your accuracy. You. But that's up to you. I don't know how much longer I'm going to be using this vest. I mean, right now it's fine, and you get extra experience and everything. But, uh, I don't know. Let's see. Let's try this way. Yeah. Where the dog goes, I don't want to go, so I can 
go more places and see more things. Break things and get more medicinal herbs. Awesome, and some gold. And we can't go into the water because we can't swim. Like every good JRPG hero, of course we can't swim. Okay, so moving and grooving right along. This is actually rather easy to get through. Oh, copper ore. Huh. I don't know what that's for. We'll have to keep that in mind. Maybe it's for, like, the alchemy pot or something like that. I know that there is an alchemy pot in this game. I don't think it's called the alchemy pot, but there's something like that. Oh my gosh, they kept the stairs sound effect in! That's all the way from Dragon Quest 1! do you think? Help! Help me! <gasps> Cole? Ah, ah! Ah! Quick! You have to help him! <laughs> Whoa! Yikes! The smogs! It kind of reminds me of the Blaze Ghosts. Whoa! Oh wow, these guys are doing a lot of damage. Ooh. Um, Gamma, could you like, do something? Thank you! Wow, so not bad, not bad, not bad at all. I could probably do more damage if I use Frizz. Oh! But now it really doesn't matter, because he's paralyzed with fear anyway. So yeah, this is pretty simple, just attack and Gamma will heal you, apparently, if you get into... If you get into a... Whoa! 44 experience points! so proud of you! Sweet! I... I'm sorry, Gemma. I only came up here because I thought it'd be funny to jump out and surprise you. But then those monsters appeared. What in the world is going on? I never heard anything about monsters appearing on the tour before. But never mind that now. Whatever were you thinking? You could have been killed. You take Sandy and get back to the village this instant. Y yes Gemma. Sorry, Gemma. You saved my bacon again. I knew you were tough, but crikey, you really have grown into quite the hero. Not far to the top now. Oh, it's that cursed rain again. Typical. It would have to go and start raining, wouldn't it? Come on, let's get a move on. But what awaits us at the top of the tour? Find out next time on Let's Play Dragon Quest XI. This has been David. If you like this, please like, comment, and subscribe. And have a good day.